kit is a Monte Carlo 2001 SS 3.8 engine. The famous GM 4T65E transmission. A lot of people get PO742. Check engine light come on. Let you know that the clutch control solenoid or TCC is not acting right. So this is what you have to do. You have to take the side cover off. Go through the valve body. You have to take off the pump, the transmission uh, fluid pump. And basically remove four different sensors. You have the shift solenoid comes in two. You have the TCC itself. And then you also have the transmission pressure control or PCV and TCC. And then you have the shift solenoid, two of these. This one is the one that went bad. Let me show you over here. It's the towel. It's my other car. Well, truck. This right here. I took it apart. But basically, but basically, this is the base. This sits here in the base. This sits in between that. And this right here would be the cover goes in here but if you look in here you can see that it's broken on the inside so when the car gets hot the transmission get warm the fluid get warm is this starts to act up and between first gear second gear into third gear you get the worst shifting in the world it's as if you're driving a manual transmission that's how much of a jerk and feedback that you get this is a TCC and as you can see the inside looks all torn up yeah I'm, I'm assuming that's what the problem was and this part was getting wet I was getting the plug and sensor and all that wet, and so this is what I was getting. So basically, I replaced this, but they say is whenever you have to open the side of the transmission to replace this, it's safe. Then sorry to replace the one to two shift, three to four shift, the TCC itself, and the pressure switch. And basically that's what I'm about to attempt to do. Got my transmission fluid. Castrol. The new fluid for GM is Dexron 6. At $7 a quart, I don't feel like spending that type of money on no transmission fluid. When I know I'm going to have to replace it again in another 30,000 miles. This car is 10 years old. You know, it's, it's been here for... Oh, wow. You know, it's hanging in there, so everything's good for now. So I'm going to see if I can put everything back together. These sensors had to be special ordered. I have no idea why. So I waited a whole week. Carbon sitting like this in the driveway for a whole week. And now uh, today's the day that I get to put something back on. As you can see, Engine cradle has been taken apart on the driver's side, loosened on the passenger side. Lower control arm, steering knuckle, everything's been taken off. And basically it, that's, that's everything so far. I'll be putting out a video of the completed project and hopefully everything goes on as planned.